Alright, welcome back dito sa Wombo X Combo and this is the Grand Finals for ESL1 Birmingham between Adjust Team Secret and Evil Geniuses. This is game number 3. Sarado tabla tayo sa uno. 1-1 uh -huh. ang ating score and IO nakalusot na naman sa ating drop and EG this time around. They will show Team Secret on how to use IO. <laughs> Pero binan nila yung Gyro. Yeah. Gyro is banned. Even the Sven is banned. Pangulier is also out. So, anong gagawin ng EG rito? Pero the Shrock still in the hands of uh, EG. And they have Yap Source, Enigma, and Death Prophet in mid-1. Yeah. So far, sa ating dalawang series, di ba, bawat team na nakakuha ng Sven na nalo? Tama ba? Yeah. yeah kasi game 1, secret niya may Sven. Tapos versus Arc Ward ni EG. O nga, tama. So, nanalo sila doon. And game 2, syempre, nakita natin din na yung Sven din nagwala. So tatanggalin na lang ng secret, sabi nila, parang ito yata yung uh, secret strategy dito sa tournament natin na to. And I think matas actually yung win rate ng Sven dito so, sa tournament na to. Eh. Hindi ko lang naalala yung uh, percentage, pero apparently Sven, baka nampik. Ayo isn't uh, 100% win anymore since no, no, natalo no. sa secret, pero EG is still relying on that high win rate or high, uh, high win rate pick, which is yung Ayo. Yep. Pero Batrider was taken out, even the TA, uh, TA Chen, Batrider and yung Morphling. Alright. So, uh, tatanggalin na lang din yung Morphling ni Nisha. Smart smart pick. No? Smart, uh, oh, sorry, smart band din. Uh, para naman hindi rin sobrang komportable itong si yeah. Nisha. But, uh, well, Spectre. So, sa ngayon, pinaban talaga eh, si Nisha for now. Tsaka kung makikita nyo rin. Uy! Tsaka, guys, reminder. Bala bukas, Oy. tuloy yung ating Civil War. Ah, pagbabalik. Yeah. Eh, siyempre, tamang promote kasi kami maglalaro bukas, eh, di ba? <laughs> Talabas natin ng ano, uh, PUBG Immortal. Oh. Off, off lay, offline. Oh. <laughs> Ang offline player ng ano, Idol Spirits. Ako yun. <laughs> so, Idol Spirits versus Genius Hunters. Yeah. So, uh, importante sa amin yun. Kailangan, importante para sa Idol Spirits. nag ng points. Kailangan namin mat yung Genius Hunters yeah. para masecure yung aming uh, top 3 slot. Hmm. Tapos waiting na lang dun sa Opa Shakers versus ano naman, versus uh, Solid Pushers. So, Kung manalo kayo doon, do or die talaga kaming dalawang team na doon. Yeah, yeah. Kami, kami, kami talag kailangan talaga ma-2-0. Oh, kailangan ma Sila, manalo lang sila ng isang beses. I think, lusot na sila eh, kung di ako nagkakamali eh. Tsaka ano yan, 3 p.m. tomorrow, uh, Idol Spirits versus Junior Santers. Yeah. Uy, pero Genius over Hunters. naman for EG. Ano yan? Uh, that will be Fly na hero. Yeah. Ogre Magi. Crit will be playing the Ayo, definitely. 100% sure. Yeah. Pero Shadow Demon. Oh my god, this is a one good counter dito sa IO. Lubog lang, wala nang tether. So may ano pa yan, may purge. Yep. Very nice. Indeed. Nakanina ah. nag-usap kami ni ano eh, ni Mao dun sa labas kung mga plano namin bukas. Wow, well, kaya pala medyo matagal-tagal na konti yung pagbalik mo eh. Kaya wala, inaanap kita sa so, asa na ba do? Para nga nag-uusap pala sila. Ha? <laughs> Papasok. Ayun nga, ayun nga, ayun nga. 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 Ayun nga, ayun Pero na siyempre, abangan din. Dapat maganda rin dapat ipapakita ng dalawang team na yan. Siyempre, manonood. Manonood din ako doon. Susubaybayan ko doon. Akala nyo lang hindi ako nagdodota. That's what you think. Akala nyo puro PUBG. Matagal lang ako nagdodota. Ano ba yan? Master Nate versus Legendary. Hindi, na, nanalo na sila Calves. Na 2-0 na kami nun. So, uh, makita naman sila Dan. Tsaka itong si Calves. Diba? Dan versus Calves. Let's go. Baka ilabas ka rin bukas yung Life Stealer. Marami uh, akong mga natatago kayo. Wife Stealer ba yan? Pre, Wife Stealer. <laughs> Ayun nga eh. Alam mo dati yung pangalan kasi nung ano. Ang pangalan dati nung account ko, yung primary kong gamit, uh, ang pangalan ng Milf Stealer. Man! <laughs> <laughs> Hindi, seryoso. Oh, yun yung pangalan ng account ko. Milf? Milf? IGN ko, Milf Stealer. Bro. Tapos nagsaspam ka ng Live Stealer. Ayan. Yeah. Alright, okay. Tapos yung uh, in Enigma, <laughs> diba? Milf Stealer. Hindi, hindi. Seriously, guys. Right, okay. May mga ano, may mga screenshots ako before. Yung uh, five-man black hole nung uh, Milf Stealer ko sa Enigma. <laughs> Tapos yung uh, five-man na uh, RP. Invoker ko rin, Milf Stealer. Let's go. Oh, let's go. Let's <laughs> go. <laughs> Ay, nako. Pero anti-mage naman yung magiging pick dito, which is okay actually versus Leshrac. Yeah, Sobrang gandang pick-off uh, pick potential na pwede magawa mo sa, sa Leshrac. Kasi Leshrac, gagamit at gagamit ng mana yan. And kapag umamot ng point na ubos na mana, syempre mana void lang, simple lang. And same with the Ayo. Kapag ma-isolate mo din yung Ayo, maganda rin yan. 
Siya, ano eh, Life Stealer pick is really good in this lineup. Meron siyang Rage. And of course, sure ako, this will gonna be um, uh, Hand of Mind as instantly far sa Life Stealer. Again, para mag-scale up yung hero, mas maunahan yeah. yung anti-mage mag-online. And they they can actually push into towers. Why? They have the less rock. They have the IO for the sustainability. Life Stealer can just tank up everything to sa tower. Habang uh, less rock naman, may diabolic edict. Sabi nga sa inyo, madali sila makakuha ng tower. So far, ang lakas ng, ano, ah, ng uh, sama-sama potential without na anti-mage ng society ng secret. Enigma at saka Death Prophet pa lang. Ang lakas na mag-push niyan. True that. So, bra. Kasi Death Prophet, Exorcism, Enigma, kasama yung mga creeps, well, Eidolons, plus isang naka-dominate na creep. Ganda rin nun uh, for, for pushing early. Especially, siguro yung power spike na ito, pag level 6 na itong, uh, Death Prophet, Siguro iikot na kagad or kukunin niya sana yung tier 1 tower dun sa mid but papayag ba yung EG yun yung problema for sure dapat hindi kaya iniisip ko din kapag mag Midas naman tong life sealer na to mag magpaka-passive lang ng konti baka alam mo yun less rock pwede rin naman ay sa pagsabag eh para namang mag ano to kuha-kuha din ng mga towers pero so far IO plus life sealer Okay lang na combo, not bad. Eh, hindi natin usually nakikita kasi no. syempre IO Tiny, IO yeah. uh, CK, IO Gyro, IO Sven Yan yung mga mas potent, but life stealer pwede rin naman. But uh, let's see kung gagana naman versus the anti-mage. Pero so far, life stealer ma maya maya siguro kailangan niyang bumali ng abyssal. Kailangan niya ng abyssal. Yeah, yeah. And of course, yung radiance. Yeah. Mangyayari lang dyan, he will instantly Uy, go for... Master. Pero kung naalanganin dito yung life stealer, mag-halbreak to. No, definitely. Yeah, pag medyo ano na, uh, playing from behind, uh, ako medyo nahihirapan na tayo, kailangan na bumali ng halberd. Pwede naman, pwede naman. So we still have, uh, I mean, Secret has a less than uh, 15 seconds to go to the side. Pero may ano pa sila rito, extra time. Actually, extra time nila, 15 seconds na lang. Yeah, so, bilis bilis. Uh, si EG naman, 20 seconds lang din yung reserve time nila. Kaya, well. Hindi tatin... naman nangangamba rito yung EG, they have the lockdown, they have the Ogre Magi. Uh, kung, uh, well, it's ESL, come on, uh, bro. <laughs> it's England. Tsaka UK yan, mga tao dyan, sabik sa esports. Yeah. Sana all lang bansa, ganun. Supportado yan. And Sand King will be picked off by Team Secret. Pangalawang, palawang, eh, sorry, pangalawang event na nga din actually yan sa, ano, sa Birmingham. Diba? Yeah, second event. Nagkaroon na ng Birmingham dati. Sand King, actually, top picked uh, hero dito sa tournament natin, pero hindi natin nakita anong Ibig first two games. Ibig sa nationals, eh. Sand King yeah. is a high pick para A sa tournament. Actually, pinaprioritize nga siya as a first pick. First pick Minsan, yan. Minsan, dahil lang ang lakas ng flexibility niya with the three or four. And sa bagay, medyo mahirap din basahin kung uh, Sand King offlane ba ito or Enigma. Pero I think, I think e the three ata nila yung Enigma. Si Centaur Warana naman yung magiging last pick dito. So Stampede, Maganda rin naman, pero so far, sino kaya? Oy, position 4 yung Enigma, and Zai will be playing the Sand King. Centaur Warrunner against the Anti-Mage sa safe lane. May return damage sa una, pero as the game progress, of course, Anti-Mage will scale up. So, may hirapan yung Centaur doon sa lane. So, the Shrak na naman, mid with Sumail, playing it. Versus naman sa Death Prophet. So, kanina na medyo masabihan naman natin yung Ember pick. Hindi gumaan eh. Uh, nahirapan siya mag-snowball. Eh. But uh, Death Prophet, mas may chance na mag-snowball, in my opinion. And maganda rin yung mga bagong aganims na ito eh. Effect, yeah. yeah? Ang kulit eh, may bagong, eh, bawat uh, effect ng skill or right click or what, may samasamang isang ghost na lumalabas. So, eh, medyo bonus lang na ganun, pero maganda. Tsaka ba bakit sa uh, Sand King? Ang dami nagagawa ng Sand King eh. Ah. Ang hirap din, tsaka yung supports, kailangan nila mag-invest sa detection. Sentry or dust during the laning phase, pero more mostly sentry. No, ano sandstorm, the power of the sandstorm during the, uh, during the laning phase. Yeah. Hindi na to yung sandstorm pag gumalaw ka, madidispel uh, na kagad. Yeah. Well, mga kapag form mga yung mga sand king yeah. during uh, yung mga kanyang sandstorm, duration of sandstorm. Yeah. So one of the magandang ano heroes talaga, and he still has the caustic finale. And lalabal niya rito, of course, yung life stealer. Yeah. Na sand king is really good on melee heroes. Sa bagay, okay din yung ano, uh, sa bagay, medyo magpa-payoff naman ata yung greediness dito ng secret. Kasi enigma na naman, eh, greedy to eh. Uh, kasi iwan mo lang yung Sand King doon sa lane, mag-isa, enigma. Farm lang sa jungle, gagawin nyo yung sarili nyong buhay. But, uh, well, again, tignan natin kung magpa-payoff na naman yung greed dito ng secret. We'll see. Tsaka viable din yung, ano, yung enigma sa pick ng secret. Sandstorm can solid the lane habang nasa ano lang to, sa shrine area or even at the jungle tong enigma. Yeah. So, 
sobrang ganda. I mean, yung uh, composition to synergy between the picks is really good for both squad. Execution-wise, dito na magkakatalo. So right sure. now, we have the Game 3 of the Grand Finals for the ESL 1 Birmingham. Team Secret versus Evil Geniuses. Tara, uh, sarado tayo sa 1. Tabla tayo mga sir, mga ma'am. So pakilala ko na for the side of Secret, we have Poppy on the Shadow Demon. Yapsor for his Enigma. Nisha for the uh, anti Magina, Magina, Zai for the Sand King, and of course, mid one on the Death Prophet. And syempre, dito naman sa side ng EG on the dire side, RTZ playing the Life Stealers, so male naman sa kanyang Leshrak ulit, Fly naman sa kanyang Ogre Magi, S4 on the Centaur Runner, and Crit naman on the Ayo. Signature hero na ito, ha? Oh. Ni Crit, pero, uy, magkikita ka agad, Poppy Smoke. smoke. Poppy with a good positioning early as expected. He was able to break the smoke. Wala na magagawa ang Team Secret right now. Yeah, pack na lang daw ka mo. So, most likely, hindi na makakapag-contest dito sa may task. Kasi, and they know, ano they know, there's uh, a lot of heroes from EG. Uh, Going for the smoke, napap kasi ni Poppy. Ang ganda na ginawa nila dito, ah. magsa-sentry ka agad sila sa dalawang uh, Camp. camps dito para hindi makapag-farm na maayos yung Enigma, which is maganda. Kasi pag ganun, mapo-force mo din na uh, sa baba naman mapupunta yung Enigma. And yung Enigma, gusto niya mag-offlane dahil lang matanggal ka agad yung, uh, yung ranged creep. Diba? Parang palagi magpa-push yan dun sa offlane side mo. Okay din yun, pabor sa offlaner yun. Pero mukhang mid-1, nandito sa may top. Ah. I think S4? S4? Anti-mage mid? Ooh, okay. anti-mage mid kontra naman dun sa, ano, sa Leshrak. Not bad yun, ha? Kasi yung gagawin lang naman dun for now, creeping si Per Poppy, syempre. Alam niya kung He bakit nag-5 man rotation He dun. Knows. May bang may bang sentry, tsaka ano, yung observer ward dito, ah. yung Shadow Demon. But then again... Oh, ganda. One sentry, two sentry wards na ko. Sulit. Well played. Sobrang well played. Two birds and one Poppy. stone. Ang ganda. High IQ plays ginawa. And uh, EG, ginasas nila. 150 gold down the drain. So right now, magandang matchup to for mid one is be, uh, being matched up to the center war runner na nakaskill up yung kanyang uh, return damage yung third skill niya. Pero, ewan ko lang men ha. Uh, it's gonna be tough for the AM. Uh, early yeah, game. Kailangan niya sobra magkaroon ng ano kagad yung uh, ito, yung sustain, syempre. So magpapadal na kagad ng self. <laughs> Kakasabi ko lang din. Look at the harassment. Kung tumama pa yung split earth, that's gonna be uh, another Uy. damage. But look at these two supports fly, <laughs> using his club, smashing the Shadow Demon's head. Uh, Chaka disruption din yung unang kinuha dito ni Papi para lang, uh, well, uh, at least wala siyang Shadow Poison, I guess, sabi ni Fly. Kaya haras hara singgo lang. Kaso nga lang, wala siyang, ano, wala siyang um, Orb of Venom. Yeah. Para mas slow din kaga itong si SD. Pero, oy, S4. S4, very sad like, disruption. Yeah, that, that, that was a pretty nice usage and disruption niya. So, makapag-fallback dito si Poppy safe. And look at the Enigma. Starting to farm up the jungle dito sa shrine area sa top. And walang problema yan. Tamang micro lang doon sa kanyang Eidolon. So, it's fine. Dem yeah. Demonic conversion is, do is good. Ito lang yung kailangan ko i-point out dito. Yung creep wave. Nandito palagi dito. And pabor yun sa mid one. Dahil nga palagi mo nakukuha yung range creep. And yung creep equil equilibrium, maganda yun for, for, ano, for secret. Siyempre, hindi nakakatakot kasi pag ito, lapit din yung OG para ma uh, si yung, uh, ogre para makalapit sa'yo, maaras ka. And mid one, most likely magkakaroon ng okay din na laning so far dito sa top lane. And right now, Sand King against the two heroes from the side of EJ. <laughs> Ayo. Ayo Lifestealer versus Zai. Ano eh, kaya na ano yan. Oy, pero Oy, the, the dust, dust, nagamit ka agad. Pero level 2 open wounds na deploy, pero may bower strike dito. Pero short yung level 1 bower strike. That's the only defensive na magagamit niya. Wala siyang sandstorm, still on cooldown. Pero he will salve himself up and he's gonna be back on the lane healthy and fine. Yeah, pag level 1 pa lang yung sandstorm, kailangan mo rin i-haras ka agad yan. Kasi pag iiwan mo lang na mag-farm lang na mag-farm yung sand king. Easy, easy levels, di ba? And napakatagal yung level 1 cooldown ng Sandstorm. <laughs> Ang kulit na sa Portal Combat dito. Disruption ginam, pero there's no follow-up for the Shadow Demon. Nope. Siya is gonna use his um, illusions ng Ogre to control. Yeah, pero syempre si Fly, medyo okay pa naman yung buhay niya dito. Hindi rin, oy, madidisrupt pa nga yung ah, pull dito. Not it's very bad. unfortunate for the Ogre Magi. Yeah. Balik tayo sa mid-matchup. So, male, Leshrak level 4. Not bad for the AM. Magka-level sila rito ng Leshrak. So it's perfectly fine, 15 to 7, 11 to 4. Lamang pang asya sa last hit. Yeah. Uh, ganun talaga with anti-mage. Ang problema mo lang kasi as an anti-mage, yung, ano, yung uh, sustainability. 
Kaya kailangan mo papagpadala palagi ng salve. Yeah, oh, may sustainable. tango siya, salve siya, and uh, we'll see. Most likely, kukuha din ng maraming levels na kapos para Actually, sa poppy kanina. Actually, chile jibake nila yan. Ito na nga nandito si S4 level 2, pero magandang ah. disruption. Nagamit ka kanil poppy. Poppy being chased out by Fly. Uy, hindi niya nakuha oh. yung block. Well played. Ay, pero nandito yung uh, Death Prophet na cancel ng hoop stomp. Pero meron pa nga na yan. Uy, masakit ah. Nakaretaliate yan. Masakit ng right click. Kumaray nga si mid one. So, let's see Poppy. Pero so far, okay pa naman kahit pa paano. And, uh, well, magagamit na yung 13 stocks dito ng retaliate. So, shout out sa inyo lahat. Good evening, guys. Well, it's actually, technically, it's good morning na. Happy Monday to everyone. Tignan mo na yung ginawa go ni Crit dito. Actually, ang ganda eh. Kasi alam niyang wala din siya magagawa versus ng Sun King eh. So, ang ginawa na lang niya, sige, maglaban-laban kayo yung dalawa dyan. Ako, magpa-farm na lang ako dito. So, greed, greedy type na ginagawa kasi dito. Kasi, ayo ayo nagpa-farm dito. Okay, fine. Enigma, nag nagpa-farm naman sa kabila. So, Bakit nila ginawa yan? Kasi nga, kung lilain pa rito yung IO doon sa Sun King, Sun King will gain the upper hand. Hmm. Gawa ng levels. Yes, experience, exactly. Dalawa yung, yung, eh. yung nag-leach ng, ano, eh, ng XP sa side ng EJ. So ginawa nila, IO has the potential to jungle but it's way too difficult. Yeah. Level 1 Spirits, hindi pa ganun ka-effective yan. Yung explosion ng Spirits. Pero still, it Crit proving it na he's an IO player. Tsaka nakailang ano din siya dito. Uy, kailangan niya mag-ingat yung mga Ancients ha. Baka makapatay din sa kanya. Uy, yung Salve nakabuhay lang din sa kanya. <laughs> Kinailangan mag-pop. I think he was planning Uy. to uh, have it stuck. Well played, ah. Pero kung sakto, dalawang, ano to, bounty rune. Makukuha nga rito, dalawang bounty, na, ba, na bote niya pa. Counter spell na gamit ka agad dito ng EM. EM is fine, is good. Tamang nga, uh, discarte lang at S4, roaming around the tree line. Samantalang Poppy on the Shadow Demon, eyeing out fly, pero that's one tanky support to go for the kill. Naglagay din sila kaagad ng sentry dito. Akala siguro ng EG, baka warded nga. Well, warded nga, pero nandun naman sa may side. Kakita yung pull camp. Dun sa lane naman sa top. But crit, sinamahan na lang muna itong si Sumail para magbigay din ng uh, battle charges. Yeah, no? Para it. na ma-region itong si Sumail. Para tuloy-tuloy na makapagbato ng mga skills. Ayun yung reason kung bakit din siya nag-rotate dito. Eh, na, Uy, tumama! Uy, tumama! Pero may blink yan. May blink yan. So, okay lang, okay lang. Healing self, again, being uh, used by the AM. So, titignan niya kung uh, mag-respond ba rito yung rune. Just in case, Regen, malay mo, para din ma-save yung shrine mo, okay din naman. Uh, so, Boy, split bird. Ito, mama. Regen nga, pero na-cancel ka. Cancel ka agad. <laughs> Sabi na, <laughs> sayang yun. <laughs> Pag nakuha sa na anti-mage yun, sold na muna siya for the next 2 to 3 minutes sa lane. Or even the last rock, pero disruption, nag pero may midnight pulse, mga sir, mga map. Boy, pero may mo -mo. Crit is also here. They want to go for the... Ah, the Krobelus. Robilus, lalaban pa sila rito. Spirit Siphon is about to be up. Uy, ginamit ko sa lahat. Yeah, 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 yeah. They need to back out. S4, si Fly running na lang. away. Fly Papay. is out. Fly is dead. Pero may return kill pa. Return kill is done. Shadow Demon for the Ogre Man is still good. Uy, hoop stunt. Inasa. Pero hindi na ibala. Uy, si Crit. Namamatay. Patay. Patay yung IO, ladies and gents. And yeah, hoop stunt will miss. And that definitely is a problem for sa EJ. Whoa. And that's a double kill for the Death Prophet ni Mid-1. Well played sa side ng Team Secret. Nakakuha pa nga ng tatlong kills doon. Ah, Mid-1, having the time of his life. Ang sarap naman ng buhay na ito ni Mid-1 na to. Exo? Na-dodge na, na nga oh. yung Lesh uh, matchup din sa Mid. And makakakuha na naman ng isang kill. Kaka-TPN lang na ito ni S4. Oh my God! S4 a dropping in is good as dead. And they will continue the onslaught here sa Tier 1 Tower sa top lane. In 7 minutes, Tier 1 is out and done. And that's a certain advantage for Team Secret. Sabi ko na nga, di ba? Pagka level 6 ka agad na ito ni uh, DP, syempre gusto niya makakuha sana ng uh, objective ka agad. And well, sa... Uh, so bagay si Zai naman, medyo chill din naman yung buhay niya sa bot. Kaya solve din yung mga lanes kahit pa paano ng Team Secret. And so far, hindi pa naman mamamatay itong si Anti-Mage. Kaya Secret, so far, doing great. Sean eh. <laughs> Ang saklap nung mga sa Centaur War Runner. No. Kaka-TP mo lang, maglalakad ka talaga. And even the EM is uh, jungling right now, going for the power threads. Wala pa siyang boots, but he already has the gloves of speed. Yeah. So, no, okay lang. Level 6 RTC. RTC continues to the uh, free farming to the bottom lane. Yep. Katulad nga na sinabi mo, magmamidas nga din siya. And uh, 
Makakita ba tayo ng Radiance? Most likely. Pero mapipilitan nga ba siyang mag... Uh, Mag-adjust ka agad ng build. Tingnan natin. Sandstorm again being used by the Sand King. Annoying skill para talaga yan dito sa Sand King. I mean, if you're playing a 1v1 tas melee ka, Sandstorm Caustic Finale, additional damage, and it's also gonna slow you down yep. pag tumama sa'yo. Best of 3, this is the best of 5, sirs. Best of 5. Grand final na po, guys. So don't forget to share. Siyempre, last game of the tournament. Pero Veil of Discord, the recipe. Aga? Nandito pa rin dito sa uh, Courier. Well, kay San King yun. Pero naman dun sa tops. Pero it's Siphon. Baba to. Mabubuhay pa nga ba? Wala na silang pang-stun. Walang Fire Blast. Walang fire blast. Well then, played mid one. DP is out. Nagamit na rin yung hoop stump dun. Isang skill na sobrang importante sa higher bracket is uh, knowing when to abuse kapag wala nang stun yung kalaban mo. True. Kasi I... pwede kasi ma... marami namang slow yung kabila, wala namang stun. So TP out mm -hmm. ka na lang kagad. Di man, o pwede, pwede yung ganun. Identify mo lang kung pwede. I was still jungling with the, uh, with the use of the spirits. Max spirits yan, level 3. 1, 3, 1 yung kanyang build dito over charge. <laughs> still at level 1. Even the tether itself, level 1. Kulit eh. Kasi kanina nakita natin pinik yung uh, Ayo for Team Secret. Hindi siya nakapag-scale kay Yapzor. Dito naman, sabi ni Mikrit, sige, uh, wala naman tayong gagawin dito sa babae. Wala naman tayong kill potential. Kung maga, mag-farm na lang ako, mag-farm ka din dyan. Tapatan mo na lang yung Sand King mag -isa. And tingnan natin, kasi kayang-kaya naman daw kama oh. ni Ayo. Pero oy, may ikutan si Poppy. Pero magandang disruption coming from Poppy. Poppy being chased of S4. S4 hoops up, connects, patay ka agad dito yung Shadow Demon. Uy, nice dodge. Ang gandang sidestep. Good sign nandito. Dito si Sai with the rotation. So Mail is dead and out. Great ka, agamit niya lang ang kanyang tether. He will be forced to use his TP. But again, Walang so stun, TP okay. out. Ba walang stun, TP out. And ito na, mid one. Pop ka agad ng exorcism. Kaganda naman for Team Secret. Objective after objective and Yapzor magbabato ng Midnight Pulse para na matanggal yung mga trees dito. Kaya para kita din <laughs> kita kung sino magtitipi in. Yeah, smart move coming from Yapzor. Para walang surprise, di ba? Walang surprise, surprise. Walang tatagal na to rin. Poppy! Poppy! And the bar strike connects. So, however, crit is here pero hindi yan enough. Pero nag-buyback. Lalaban ng dito yung Team EG. E, uh, RTZ going in for mid one. Tandaan mo may spirit dyan and they will take out yung Sand King. Pero S4 still alive. Spirit Siphon nagamit na rin. And, oy! Mata, oy! And nice meron disruption. May, 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 may black hole pa to, ah. And meron Yapsor will be taken out. 3, 4, 1. Kapalit ng buhay lang dun is yung Ogre Magi na nag-buy back instantly. Even though hindi, Exo was popped. Lahat sila nag-group up sa mid lane. Not pero bad. hindi nila nakuha yung, to, yung tower. Galing. Galing din yung ginawa ng ano din, na EG din eh. Kasi... Nakait nila successfully yung potential multiple man black hole as well as yun nga nagamit din yung stampede pang engage kapag kasi sa early pa lang pwede mo rin kasing if you oh oy, oy, may sentry oy, 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 oy. may sentry yan power strike will be used Muntit art easy also is also there he was about to uh, pop yung kanyang open wounds to go for the sand king yep. sabi ni EG habang maaga pa tapatan na lang muna natin yung exorcism kasi kapag bigay lang tayo ng magay ng mga heroes uh, sorry mga towers na to Mahirapan tayo sa late game kasi free farm na lang yung anti-mage. Yung map control, mababawas nga uh, for the side of EG. Hindi na makakapag-TP out. Contest yung anti-mage, push out yung mga lanes. Kaya importante na makakapag-protect ka din ng mga towers na yan. Kaya kapag, again, hintayin mo lang na exorcism na exorcism, tower after tower itong secret na to. Eventually, matatalo ka din afterwards. They need to get the AM, which is ito na nga yung gagawin dito. Pero walang stampede as of the moment. And how will you catch an AM? Moving out slowly here in the dire jungle. Siya parang yung may high ground. Oh, kita! Oh, kita! Nagtatang ang observer ward. And they're currently... Oh! Oh! No! 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 Air! The burst out! The timing! That was so... So unlucky para kay Nisha. Nakita ko na to eh. Nakita ko na to eh. Sa Dananchalas, ginawa din yun eh. Nag-TP in. Nakapag... Ay, nako. Nakita na natin yun. Yung farming pattern kasi, yung farming pattern. Yun lang din yung problema kasi yun, yun yung ginagawa talaga ng anti-mage. Eh. Blink from the camp to camp para mas accelerate talaga yung farm mo. Kaso nga lang, hindi niya hindi rin niya kasi alam kasi nakasmoke din naman. Bakit lucky ng blink na yun sa so totoo lang. bad luck nga lang. Pero yun nga Nisha, yeah, it, it's bad. And, ma, and madedelay din pa yung Battle Fury timing mo. And look at the next, uh, I mean, uh, Arteezy's uh, Naix or Lifestealer is a bottom lane. Still looking good. As of the moment, 13 minutes into our game number three, Sarado tabla tayo sa sais. This is a high contested game. This is actually a good series to watch. Grand finals. I mean, sobrang ganda nung matchup nato.
Yeah, the best two teams dito sa tournament natin. And before nga nung tournament na to, sinasabi natin, parang mini TI na to eh. Kulang lang si VP Halos v, uh, TI na nga yung dating nung tournament. Kasi, so, karamihan ng mga teams na to, pasok na sa TI. True. So, medyo may konting insight na tayo na kung, kung ano yung makita talaga natin sa TI 9 uh, uh, this coming August. Yeah, so, for excited for the TI. Sobra. And our TZ already has the hand of Midas. Pero tama, mag-perform lang yan eh. eh kailangan niya yung regions. He really needs the regions yeah. as early as possible. Yeah, matapatan kung maga yung Battle Fury timing ng uh, anti-mage. And kagandahan kung maunahan pa nga din yun para mas mauna din siya mag-scale. And so far, Lifestealer. Nasa taas ng net worth natin. Uh, uh, yeah, 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 it's good, it's good. Jesus Christ. So far nga, Lifestealer, tuloy-tuloy pa rin yung pag-aangat uh, niya dito sa net worth. Pero syempre, pag naka-Battle Fury na itong anti-mage na to, tuloy-tuloy din yung sa kanya. And so, male, level 11, Poppy, just waiting on the three line, level 6. May dagger, sino yung nag-dagger? Uh, Ay, AM pala, sorry. AM, My bad, AM. AM. That was the AM. Similar din kasi yung, ano, yung, <laughs> yung sound doon eh. Pero kulang na lang ata dito for anti-mage, just yun nga yung demon edge na lang. Yeah, well, so far, ito na naman. Medyo passive na yung nangyari dito so far. Looking for alam the items ng muna dito, yung al bawat team. Eh. Alam mo na gagawin dito ng EG. Oh. Sumail so, gonna go for the BKB. Then magpupush na kagad silang tower. Yun lang inihintay nila rito, yung BKB ni Sumail. After getting the BKB, instantly they will group up. Oy, bounty runes. The fight for the bounty. Pwede atin na i-goat si Midwan pag nahuli. May stampede sila if ever. Pero oy, maaagawan. Midwan nakakuha and nice this... Pero may ano ah, may black ah, hole. Snappy instantly uh, used dito ng EG uh, well, and they will run into safety. Yun nga lang ginamit mo for siya, siya for defensive purposes. So hindi ikaw yung manguuna. Which is, katulad ng sinabi mo, BKB timing neto ni Sumail. Pwede silang magsama-sama na mag-push, uh, mag sorry. Then for EG and the... Uh, Importante din yung stampede pang uh, engage and maybe even disengage. Kasi nga lang disengage. Kasi yung cooldown yung ng EXO eh. Sure, may exorcism, pero... Medyo matagal-tagal eh. Cooldown dependent hero yan. Pero the, again, the side of Team seconds. Secret, nasa ano sila? Uh, they want to uh, take out the tier 1 tower talaga dito sa mid lane. Mid pero Zai, nakablink dagger na to. Ah. Epicenter oh potential na mangyayari dito. Pero oh, ito na, na nga. Na, na. Hindi siya kita. Sumail oh! yung mga dito. Hey, Sumail po being forced Kaso out. Kaso si S4, ganda namang... Initiates the backline. Pero meron ano, black hole na gamit na agad. Solo black hole for S4. S4. So male. Sumil. Oy. Papay. Was taken out. You relocate. Hindi umaw. Pero eto na. Yung life stealer going in. He's still gonna go ham par dito kay mid one. Spirit cyborg na gamit ka agad. Kay fly. Your exorcism damage. Masakit na. And the sustain. Oy. And the sad storm. Two heroes out. Double kill kay mid one. Our, our TZ is still going for mid one. He really, really wants this kill. Pero mamama na rin dito si crit. Pero RTC, trabaho lang, sir. Pero same goes for the anti-mage. So top lane, yung Magina, tapong farm lang din dito, Nate. 3 for 4 trade yung nangyari doon. And uh, well, halos pantay lang. Pabor naman dito sa EG dahil lang high value kill yung nakuha nila in terms of uh, with this uh, death profit. Pero namatay din itong si Lashrak. Still 16 minutes. 10-9, first 10 kills, nakuha pa rin dito na Team Secret. Yeah. Nisha still farming on his anti-mage na meron ng uh, Battle Fury. Yan. So yung uh, pag-aangat uh, pag naman na nito, polynomial na. Tataas at tataas na yung uh, farming potential nito. And uh, we'll see kung gagana nga yung ganun. Makagawa ba ng space itong Secret? May rage naman, may rage naman. Yeah, it's fine, it's perfectly fine. Ooh. May stampede din, nagamit ka agad. Magda-dagger out dito yung isang hero. Ooh. Muntik na naman yun, okay. ha? Muntik na naman yun. Pero ginamit din yung Demonic Purge doon kay Lifestealer, yun nga lang, may Stampede. Yeah, this, so this, pag wala yung Stampede noon, I think baka kaya pa nilang uh, patayin itong CRTZ. But halos sabay lang din yung timing ng Radiance as well as yung uh, Battle Fury dito for both these scores ng EG and Secret. And again, just a matter of kung sino lang makakapull off na mas magandang initiation para sa akin. Then, and yeah, Radiance is up. They're uh, rallying out these bottom lane. Sand King is here. Poppy is also there. Ayan nga power strike. Pero Rage up the dodge. And that's an easy pick off far as side ng Evil Geniuses. So, Matalik Desai will just uh, gonna blink out in the tree line. Cutting out trees. Pero meron oy, spirit. Oy, oy, May spirit. Oy, oy, oy. Ay, 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 ay. Pero spotted kay Dancer. Nakita yung yun lang. And this is an easy kill. And they will give it to Sumail. Sumail with a kill, 300 gold, pero yung top thing nila, naka-push in. Yep. 
power of anti-mage. Yun lang din yung problema mo pagkatapat mo kat pagkatapat po nga etong anti-mage na to. Eh, cutting creep, cutting waves. Yun lang din yung problema mo. Hindi kasi nagagawa ng life stealer yun. Mas mobile talaga sa mapa itong life uh, anti-mage na to. Kaya mas mataas yung potential niya para mag-farm. Yeah, Pero I think na. EG gusto rin kasi nila magsama-sama na mag-push with the Slash Rock eh. Payasya na rito yung anti-mage ni Nisha. Level 15. Currently level 15. Mahirap na huliin to. Yeah. Sobra. Especially pag uh, makakuha na rin to ng, uh, ito, ng Manta. Pero ano ah, bibili siya ng dalawang ultimate orb. So baka next item niya, Skadi. Para lang tagos din sa rage na ito. Para kite potential or slow potential. Pwede rin magamit. Added stats, slow Tank ability. Sa bagay, okay din kasi versus ano yun eh. Um, okay din yun versus Leshrak. Kapag meron kang plus strength, di ba? Yung tankiness mo. But mid one, may nakikita ako dito. Aganims to. Aganims. Yeah. Ta -ta Para sa akin, one of the uh, heroes talaga na sulit if you go instantly first item uh, Aganim yeah. Scepter yep. for the uh, uh, Death Prophet. So, so sulit, sulit, sulit. Yeah, very nice. Pero uh, very nice Barrow Strike. Barrow Strike connected. Oy, aray ko! Sakit ng damage. Yung Demonic Purge nun eh. Ay, sorry, the money purchase. Yung, ano, yung uh, soul catcher. Kasi pure damage yung tinata. Tsaka current health lost. 40%. Eh, tanky pa naman din na hero itong Ogre Magic nito. And I think, especially itong center na to, aaray din tumamaya. Kasi naturally, mataas yung strength gain nito. Well, they use the XO. Yun na nga, ginamit ng exorcism. They want Roshan. However, EG, will they contest this Roshan? For the side of Team Secret, S4 positioning himself. Here comes Lashrak. Sumail coming in. Here comes the fight. Barsrak will connect on one. BKB got it to Sumail. BKB and the Black Hole on two. And the Centaur One Runner is dying again. And here's the Ion, the Tether out. But who will win? Sumail is in trouble. Sumail is dead. So it's a mid one. He's not going to die. And he's not going to die. And Fly dropping like a fly. He's about to drop, but he's not going to die now. But with the disruption, the set of RTG on the other hand. Mid one with another kill. Now, oh my god, wow! The mana void! The mana void! Sobrang sulit ng mana void, and they will take out four heroes pa sa EG. Nakait na rin na itong life stealer na to. Well, makagawa ta siya ng damage dito, Yapsor. Uy, muntik na nga yun. Well, cancel the TP naman, yung ginawa na yung anti-mage dun. So, tuloy-tuloy na lang muna siya mag-perform. Pero, one for four trade, going the way of Team Secret. And the bounties, man. Bounties. Well, buhay, buhay din yung Roshan dun, but I think Secret na bait nila yung team fight na yun. And kagandahan naman for Secret kasi nakuha na nila yung, yung black hole on the center na hindi na nakapag-stampede. Sobra importante yung stampede na yun kasi yung kite potential. Ay, na first up, our strike will also connect. The shot is here. They need to back out. But yung nga, stampede Stop instantly it. being used. They want the tower and they will take the tier 1. Oh, Look at the score. He blinks in. He wants the Shadow Demon. However, on the back line, and dito na lalaman ni Zai. Oh, na trap. Ay, my God. S4 is out again for another 40 seconds. And they need to back out. They need to back out right now. Puntikan din pa si RTC din dun. And uh, well, as this goes on, anti-mage, syempre, doing anti-mage things. Nagsisplit push lang sa mapa. Muntik niya rin. Well, napapressure niya yung bot tower dun sa baba and na-force na lang na mag-TP itong si RTZ. And uh, tingin ko, napapatagal na laro ng Team Secret to and pabor sa akin nila yun. And look at Team Secret, smoking instantly after winning a fight. Lapit na rin na. 17 seconds na na yung extra season oh, dito. Oh, 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 oh. Fly, blink Boy, in. Oh, warning a fly. Kita ka dyan. And that's another death pa dito sa Ogre Magi ni Fly. Walang sagot dito yung EG. Again, typical anti-mage things. Lilitaw, makakakuha ng, well, hindi nyo naman siya yung nakakuha ng kill. Pero kill, sige, go mo. And then after nun, Back to farming, or in this case, Roshan naman. And Exorcism na naman pinap. Second time in a row para lang dito sa Roshan na to. And I think successful naman yung pag-take nila. Uncontested na. And they will get the Ace of the Immortal. Ahawa ka niya ni Nisha on his anti-mage. Sobrang sulit na ito, man. Skadi nga yung next item dito ng AM. Yeah. It's gonna make him much, much more tanky, tanky and scary. Stats, damage din, everything, no? intelligence, strength, whatever, lahat magagamit talaga. And yung pinaka-importante kasi Skadi, isang hard counter para nga dito sa Lifestealer. Kasi kahit naka-rage ka, affected ka pa rin ng Skadi slow. The slow... Attack speed slow and the movement speed slow. Stats talaga, parang napaka-importante. Look at the Lifestealer. 
Baka, well, he has the range. I mean, Pero range. He, alam mo yun, yung parang mag-radiance kayo and then you go back for the arm. Medyo med hindi, hindi optimal yung ganun. And well, Desolator yung kanya next item, which is goods naman. Pero yung lockdown nyo for the anti-mage, asan na? And Tsaka yung burst potential on mid one, asan na? And 23 minutes, tier 2 is down at the middle lane. Last outer tower na lang ng EG is yung nandun sa bottom lane. Oh. Tier 1 and tier 2 is still up, however... <laughs> They Naka, still have the ages, they can go for the objective. Naka bloodlust yung tier 3 tower dun, medyo kit nga lang. Bilis nung tumira eh, pero ito na fly. Oh, Patuma na lang ulit, pero uy, dito Nisha. na si Nisha. Nisha will just go in. So, Mail, they're currently smoked up. Lalaban mo sila, RTZ. RTZ positioning himself, pero wala silang mahahabol dito sa side ng Team Secret. Yan nga lang. Tsaka pinakita mo na rin na meron kang Desolator. Medyo battle ready na nga itong Lifestealer na to. Kasi yeah. alam din nila na kahit wala pang malaking items yung Antimage, sumasali na eh. Dahil lang din yung space na nagagawa ng Exorcism. Pag mag-commit ka sa Clash na yun, EG, kailangan nila sure sila na makakapag-commit talaga while oh, stopping ka gamitin. Ito, Enigma, this is actually a good target. Nandito yung relocate na huli si Yapsur. Oh, hey. Yapsur committing for the, uh, the black hole. Pero that's not an ideal fight. Ah, kala niya siguro mas tatagal din siya sa... sa ano, well, tatagal yung buhay niya dun para lang makapag... Re, re, sorry. Makapag-respond din yung kakampi na ito yeah, ni malapit, Medyo malapit lang, pero hindi ito yeah, maganda yung buhay niya. Ang bilis eh. Tsaka, syempre, di mo rin nalam kung sino yung kasama dun eh. Siguro... Iniisip niya, uy, baka lifestealer ito eh. Pero hindi, less shrack eh. Uy, pero nakita ng EG, may movement. Here comes the blink in. So, Mail, you gotta go in. Pero problema dito, Centaur One Runner is about to drop. S4, S4 is out. S4 is down. Lalaman si Sumail with the BKB. Mid one. Mid one dropping. And he's about to be taking out. Wala na kakaniti yung Crobelus. And Sai with his Sand King. Nasa three line lang. He needs to blink out. Yes, he was able to blink out. Pola, pola, pola. Nakahuli! Nicely done for EG! And they will take out four heroes para dito sa side of Team Secret. That was like a 4-4-1 exchange. Nga, including din yung Enigma na napatay din nila. And again, na-force din nila yung black hole na yun. And Nisha lang naman yung buhay dito. And uh, hindi rin siya makapag-pressure ng lane dito eh. EG staying alive in this game number three sa ating grand final. And uh, Oh, alawits lang. Alawits lang sa anti-mage sabi ng Team Secret na to. Pero yun nga lang kasi, nasurround ka agad yung Death, death Prophet dito. Hindi natin i-expect Blink Dagger from Sumail on that last rock. Para lang maklose yung distance, mapal Nova mo lang, mapunta lang yung Diabolic Edict dun sa damage onto that Death Prophet para ma-burst mo ka agad. And kulang din yung uh, Spirit Siphon dun na makakapag... Uh, Deso yun, boy. <laughs> and the Deso. And the Deso. <laughs> ramdam ko yung right click. Bawat kalamit ni Arthur doon. Ramdam na ramdam ng DP. Unlike earlier, uh, I mean the early team fights, na hindi enough yung uh, damage ng EG. However, on, uh, right now, mga palag na rito yung EG. Yeah, tignan mo rin yung next item ng Death Prophet dito. BKB. Dahil lang sa, sa burst damage na pwede ba ito ng EG with the Centaur. Potential multicast na stun dito ng uh, Ogre Magi. And obviously, yung Leshrak. And kumuha lang din siya ng... Uh, ito... Ano lang, casual plate mail lang para lang din makapagtangkap sa kanya. Kasi yun nga, alam niya rin kasi na masakit na itong life sealer na to with that desolator. And dadagdag pa nga yung assault kiras mamaya. The AC will gonna cause another problem din sa side ng uh, Team Secret. Pero Nisha just needs to keep on farming, keep on scaling. And he will surely carry this team. And that's the plan for uh, Team Secret right now. Para tingin ko for the next 5, maybe even to 10 minutes. Uh, medyo magiging passive lang muna yung Team Secret just because kailangan nga itong BKB na to kasi nakikita na nila na burst na yeah, yung Death Prophet natin yeah, dito naman, kailangan na ito kasi mabuhay tuloy-tuloy sa Clash kasi damage over time yun na napoprovide naman ang Exorcism and kapag yan maburst lang ka sa Clash mo sino yung mag ano <laughs> oy oy yapso 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 or that was a close call for him but the pop you age of the immortal, they need to back out. Sanki will bower strike. But my tether oh. oh, the man avoid canceling. Yung tether, but still, crit is alive and kicking par side ng EG. They were able to take out the pop you age of the immortal, man. Okay, na nga yun. And the uh, oh, game natin nagiging interesting na. Kasi umapat na sa late game. This is not done yet. Hindi, hindi, hindi. Hindi hindi. To. This is still anyone's game. Pati sa dalawang team. Sa mga, sa mga tune ng grand finals to, best of five. This is game number three. Tayang ang series natin, 1-1. Shoutout din sa ating 617 viewers dyan. Solid kayo. 2.30 na nga, pero todo supporta pa rin sa bawat team dito. EG versus Team Secret. Top quality dotes ang yeah, nakikita yeah. natin dito. Makita mo naman, Game 3, 1-1. One, one. Pantay pa rin kahit pa paano. And in this Game 3, 1K lang yung lead ng Team Secret. 
As you said, it's anyone's game. Uh, hindi ba totoo? Unlike kanina, parang igis ka na mo. Hindi. Hindi. Hindi pa rin. And, uh, Ah, well, life stealer na kapag scale pa rin kahit papano. Kasabay nga itong anti-mage na to. Makita mo naman, 20k. Yung mga solo kills kasi nakukuha nila dito. Yung damage output, hindi na naman na kahit itong core dito ng EG. And secret, again, kailangan pa rin nila yung mga items na yun para na makapag standard ground yung death profit na to. Kapag kasi you're spending your time running away, mahirap yun para sa'yo. Ikaw kasi yung magtatangke, eh. spirit siphon, para na mabuhay ka sa clash. Pag mag-commit yung EG naman, or over-commit after na magamit yung Stampede, sila naman yung delikado. Tsaka yung ano, Central War Rano, he's gonna go, uh, gonna go for the Aghanim Scepter. Added damage reduction. Uh, damage reduction. 40% yun during okay. uh, yung Stampede na yun. Sobrang importante yun. And tsaka unobstructed. Yeah. Yung uh, exactly. paligid o daan. Yeah. And AC na rito si, si RTC all of a sudden. Exactly. So medyo ito nga Abisan si Nisha, aaray na rin. But Zai, ito na naman eh. Parang Mars din niya kanina. Naghihintay, nalilitaw yung isang taho ng, or isang hero ng EG sa top. Pero mukhang wala nga munang lalabas. And Nisha successfully makakapag-split push nga dito. And bottom, yeah, na nakapush yun dito. Push wave. out lang din I think ulit. they're gonna try to pressure the bottom lane. Pero same goes for the Sand King. Even yung si Nisha on his anti-mage na dito sa top. They'll continuously pressure din yung uh, tier 3, pero nandun yung Ogre Magi. Ogre Magi can defend. He has Ignite. Oh! 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 They know! They know! Oh! Nag-blink it! Nahuli! Pero may rock on the spell! Stampede! Relocate! Ay! 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 Will they still go for this AM? No, sir! Nakapag-blink out. Hindi nila na-lockdown in time. Yun lang din yung problema nila. Kanina po ang sinasabi, asan yung lockdown nyo onto this anti-mage? And... Mukhang hindi rin siya in a rush para mag-BKB kasi alam niya naman. Pero tignan mo naman yung next item. Medyo unorthodox na, na, na item pickups na hinahita natin dito. Skadi as well as an Assault Curas. Para lang din, patas lang yung Assault Curas nun sa kabila. Armor, makakatulong yan sa kakampi mo. And eventually din, Shivas din for uh, the DP naman. Pero medyo nagsastruggle lang siya maghanap ng farm dito. Kanina pang siya... Kanit pa siyang stuck on the Ogre Axe waiting for nga yung uh, Mithril Hammer as well as yung recipe ng BKB. Pero siya, short commercial break. Shout daw kay uh, Kil uh, Kilkoy Butcher as well as si Ayano, Eman, Jake. Then of course, shout kay Yoko Claudio po, uh, Fujimoto. Yeah, shout sa'yo sa Japan. 3.30 na raw doon. Game 1, since Game 1 parang siya nanonood. Shout sa'yo guys, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Even the 150 star, William John Sarmiento. What's up sa'yo John? Hey. So back to the ball game. 30 minutes in, 18 to 16 pa rin na ating score. Ang hirap kasi huli nung ano eh. Yung lockdown dito ng EG, it's really hard to, um, you know, yeah. go for the AM. Ang dami nilang kinumit dun dun eh. Relocate, stampede, para lang matry mahuli itong anti-mage na to. And nakita kasi nila with that ward na nakalagay dito kanina. Dahil lang, uy, nasilip natin. Nag-blink pa ganun. Game nga natin to, pakakasunga lang. Kulang pa rin. Hindi mangyari ulit yung nangyari kanina. Nag-blink up siya dun or nag-blink down na nahuli siya. Hindi daw ah, mangyari ulit, sabi ni Nisha. And uh, finally, BKB, <laughs> mabubuo na dito ng death profit. Pero mukhang wala ta siyang buyback dito. At check na natin yung uh, buyback status. Yeah. Binili niya, binili niya. So, wala uh, so 1.1k gold yung kulang niya so far. But uh, ang tanong, magkocommit na ba ulit si Secret going for those objectives? Kasi next na objective na lalabas dito is Roshan. 1 minute and 15 Passion. seconds. Basher. <laughs> Ito yung sinasabi natin yung lockdown. Abyssal. Kailangan na kailangan yan versus anti-mage. And okay din for the uh, life stealer kasi pwede siya mag-rage and abyssal right afterwards para hindi rin mapunta sa kanya yung, uh, yung spell block na pwedeng yun nga maklik ng anti-mage. So right now, naka smoke up yung team secret. They want to go for a fight. They want the uh, they want to bring the fight for EG. Oi, nasa lower ground and the blink in power strike and Wait, the connection. Pero mga pag race up, lalaban sila rito. Reset, reset. At yung uh, hindi na tama rito, is split earth nandun na rin yung ano, yung stampede. The power of the stampede is that they disengage. Pero mid one will Oy. throw his silence. Oi, bumalik so, ni one na lang. Wala na magagawa. This is a dead io. Yep, wala eh. Nakapag-relocate uh, eh. And uh, tamang timing nga lang ba for Team Secret. 20 seconds na lang dito sa Roshan. Kung tatambay lang sila sa loob dito, nang mas konti pa makikita nila ka sa 16 seconds, lalabas sila. Ay, nako. Ooh. This game, pantay pa rin. Yes, nakakuha ng konting advantage na yung Team Secret dito. And malaking uh, pick-up na item for the uh, Death Prophet with the BKB. I mean, for me, uh, I mean, in my opinion, but before that, eto na dapat pwes. They know Kita RTC nila, is here. Sumuso rin yung creep wave eh. Sand King is here. He can instantly blink in. Yapsor still has the black hole. 
Pwede nila yung commit. Walang stampede ngayon, Nate. Walang stampede. Even Sumil is really far off sa kanyang teammate. And ito, BKB na yung inigma dito. Paano nila pipigilan? Pero mid-1 na naman. Magko-commit ng Exorcism for the third time this game para sa Roshan. First time na go nila yung EG right after nung uh, Roshan. Pero second time na kuha nila. Third time, mukhang too late yeah, for too late. EG. Too late. Hindi damage, na makakalapit. The damage is more than enough to take Roshan in less than one minute. And then, guess what? Aegis again is in the hands of the anti-mage for Nisha. So Mel is even smoke up. Same goes for the other uh, uh, players from EJ. Yeah. They'll try to rotate at the bottom lane. One hero from uh, the side of Secret is here. Zai will just blink in safely on the tree line. Safely nga ba? Ito lang malapit na Nag naman. Nag-TP out. EG, nag yung smoke with RTZ. He's out. He's out. Yep. Makakapag-TP out naman si Zai on that Sand King. And uh, ito yung konting timing ng EG na pwedeng gamitin. Alam nilang ginamit na yung Exorcism dito. And actually, tignan nga lang natin to. Aegis binigay sa Anti-Mage, imbes dito sa Death Prophet. Kasi kapag itong Death Prophet na to, pag binigay mo yung Aegis dyan, mawawala kasi Exorcism yan yeah. pagkabuhay ulit eh. Bali, Kaya wala. kapag ma-prolong mo yung buhay niya with the cheese, tuloy-tuloy lang yung Exorcism. Smart place coming out from a secret. Pero common sense lang din, sa totoo lang. So ngayon, medyo na magiging passive tayong bahagya din sa ating game. Uh, actually, I think tingin ko, hihintay lang ng ata uh, ng uh, Team Secret na mag-cooldown yung... Uh, yung exorcism, tapos pwede na sa loob gum gumaw eh, pwede mag-push okay, eh. Kasi yun lang na naman hinihintay nila, BKB as well as Cheese and Aegis para dito sa Team Secret and uh, EG. It's all, it all comes down to kapag pwede nilang maturtle itong laro ng konti. Magamit nila na, oy, kapag nag-commit ng exorcism to and matalo natin sila sa clash, pwede mag-push yung EG. Tsaka ano, okay ba yung build ng ngayon? It's been a while, sir. It happens in pubs, but... Bihira ito sa mga professional level na games. And he's gonna go for the butterfly next item. Yeah, yung pinaka-standard kasi nakikita natin from Anti-Mage is, uh, well, Threads, tapos Battle Fury, Manta, Into Heart, or maybe even ba Butterfly muna. But hindi natin na-expect yung mga Assault Kiras, Skadi. Pero din kasi nika-itemize din to for that lifestealer. Yeah. Makakapag... Uh, Buff ka lang ng konti dun sa Death Prophet para mabuhay din na mas matagal. Pero 10 seconds na lang yung uh, exorcism dito ng uh, Death Prophet. Alam nila, ginagamit yung rage. Uh, Zai is moving in. He knows na ginagamit na pero I think they Oy, want to... RTG, walang buyback to ha? Walang buyback yan. Napop, maghahabol. Nandiyan na, tether out. Marina maghahabol. Oh, Oy, No, no, no! Pero may Stop effect. It. Pero may uh, defensive action. I mean, uh, disruption. Nagamit Comment ang lahat. Na. Oh, kinumit ng lahat kay Arthur and RTG is down. Poppy is about to go down, so Mail is in trouble. Bar strike, hindi pa pasok yan, pero AA with the right clicks. So Mail, out ka na rito, boy! Two for one, and Secret pulls out the lead. This is a fight. They will come on top against EG. Boy, mag-aabal pa rin, Crit. Or itong si Fly. Actually, wala natin silang pakilam. Si Ayo na lang din yung pakangalo, pero nice tether naman coming out. From the Ayo, pero S4 naman dito, mag-go naman ang Zai. Epicenter, boy! Oy, nag-go sa bot. And ito, mamabatay ako si S4. Oy, stun gagamitin, but nice setup. And I think kahit pa paano patay pa rin ito. Pero oy, Nisha, ginigaw na lang itong supply. Walang mana, and he has to... Patay si S4. Patay nga si S4. Nag-dive back, I mean, nag-dive back ni Nisha to Demon. And first lane of Rox, makukuha ng EG. No life stealer sa loob ng 50 seconds. 40 seconds out, hindi nila siya. And then we'll go for the GG push. Bubble Force kaya mag-buyback ni Centaur Pero he doesn't have the stampede And look at Team Secret Safe play na lang gagawin nila dito Yes, alam nilang tatlo lang yun na buhay dito And position 1 and position 2 yung patay for EG But 30 seconds na lang mabubuhay na yung mga yan And I think susulitin na lang nila Two lanes of racks na lang daw muna Tapos back na lang tayo Kasi mahirap na pag ginawa natin yung tier 4 And first. hindi na tayo makapag-push Or matanggal yung Ancient And well played Coming from Team Secret, pero I think mas okay. nakakamali lang kasi si Arthur dun eh. Hindi siya nakapag-save ng buyback, pero uy, hindi mo mafukwag oh yan, God, sir! Oh my God, This is not trouble, pero S4 popping up the stampede. Fire Blast ginamit ka agad. Oh, hindi tumama doon split earth, pero will they fight? So, male blinking aggressive. Nahuli ka agad dito support. Papi is about to go down. Papi is dead. Sino Papi ka muli doon? Wala na. Pero nandito, oh, 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 stealer. Nakatetor dito kay RTZ. They want to go for Yapsor. Yapsor, Blink Dagger still on cooldown in less than 8 seconds. Tatama pa rin yung spirit. Yun lang ang reset. Oh, the four staff. Nicely done. Well played kay Zion. And the walang punishment na mangyayari. Nakita ko lang kasi bago namatay itong si RTZ, binili niya kasi yung Vanguard. Naubusan siya ng pera para makabili or makapag-buy out or buy back. And EG... 
It's the little things. Kinumit na nga din yung, ano eh, yung uh, black hole doon kay RTZ. Para lang din, kasi ma-force out mo kagad yung buyback noon. Pabor din sa'yo, pero S4. Oh, oh, Umit oh, one, oh, big oh, hit. Pero na-force up again from the Zion King. Abyss of Lake na gamit na rin kagad dito. Nasaan ang follow? Hex up, na-control. Okay, lalaman sila. Another power strike on two. And then BK put away. Wasa yung black hole na! Nagamit na nga. Nagamit sa tao! Black hole on three. That's a dead three. Uh, three two cores. And will they catch? No! Oh, that na was a really yun. close call. Close call, but then again, they were able to take out RTZ. Once again, wala na naman buyback to. Parehas din dito kay Sumail. And yung confidence level ng Team Secret, syempre nandyan na rin na Stampy gagamitin accidentally. I don't know, man. I don't know. EG, I don't know. Pag ako to, medyo tilted na ako ng konti. Ha? Kasi once again, wala na naman buyback yung dalawang core mo dito. Problema yan. Kasi hindi ka na makaka-def ng high ground dito. Yes, ginamit na yung met, yung exorcism. Pero I think yung MVP play dun sa part na yun. Sino yung nakabili ng Lotus Orb dito? Yun talaga yung nag-turn around. Eh. Kasi bi eto, <laughs> Zai, of course. Four staff saves, Lotus Orb na ginagamit. Napaganda yung bumalik, ginagawa ni Zai dito. Bumalik yung side of vice, yung hex. Yung, It, uh, yung... Well played. Well played lang. It's the little things once again. In EG... Wala, I think kailangan lang na talaga nila mag-reset kasi mamimega creeps na sali dito. Pwede naman umakit ng high ground to. Ma-up uh, na yung exorcism in 67 seconds. Not too fast. Pero It once again, madedelay ba nila to? Yun yung tanong. Pero this is a dead IO. And that's in heaven. Ayan, nag-buyback na kaagad. Five seconds to go. Lashrock is about to up. I mean, same goes for RTC sa Lifestealer. Pero wala na. Mega creeps na to, mga sir, mga ma'am. This is... Problem for EJ. Safe play. Safe play, sabi ng Team Secret. Sige, pwede naman tayo mag-reset. Hintayin natin yung Roshan. exorcism. Hintayin natin yung black hole and hintayin natin yung Roshan. Maybe, kasi pagka-cool down naman na itong mga to. Pag up yung Roshan, take mo na rin. But so far dito sa game natin, may isang instance lang ata na napunta sa EJ. And I think dito sa may uh, mga pan ng 15 minutes, yeah. bumaba ng konti pero after na hindi na bumalik. So far, tuloy, tuloy. 20, Team Secret yeah. in control. 25k network lead para sa side ng Team Secret. Holding out the kill lead as well. 26 over 18. What can you ask more if you're Team Secret? And alam ng Team Secret na hindi makakapag-go itong lifestealer na to pag makait mo, maka 4 staff, maka lotus orbs, mabuhay lang ng konti oh. after dun rage duration ng lifestealer. Oh. Pero ito na, nagahanap sila. Oh. Yapsor, right easy. Nakita nila oh. first and pass! Trouble for the side of EG. RTZ raise up and he will back out. Ah, yung IO makatas. No, there's a dead. The lamina is our tour. Tag dito ni KEM. Yo, lang na to. Oh my god. The damage. Walang buyback na naman. This is over. Like I said, this is over. They can't contest the fight. They can't fight anymore. And GG. 2-1 kagad dito. Secret leading the game. Nag-DC kagad si RTZ dito. Medyo nagiging emotional na ata ang ating laban with an EG but Team Secret syempre kailangan mo pa rin ibigay sa kanila ah ay 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 Grand Finals preview na ba to for TI9 Grand Finals pero man I mean as for getting tilted using the stampede ah, nagkamali din siya pero din kasi once again yung vanguard na binili ni RTZ nun, wala siyang buyback eh. nahuli siya ang daming kinumit pag kasi makapag buyback yung life sealer dun Walang, uh, walang exorcism tong Death Prophet na to. Walang black hole yung enigma. Pwede siguro gumo ulit yung EG, but it came to a point na yun nga. Nakapag dalawang racks na rin yung Team Secret and once again, tuloy-tuloy and mid one Death Prophet. Doon sa taas pa lang eh. Ang ganda rin ng nangyari doon sa taas. Sa lane pa lang niya, ang ganda rin. And nag-pay off nga din. And minute one pa lang. Na-deward na kagad yung mga sentry. Nakapag-farm tuloy si Enigma. <laughs> Well, well played from Team Secret Poppy with the mind plays. 200 IQ, ladies and gents. Well anyway, played. anyway, this is uh, still a best of five. EG still needs to win to force a game number five. This Pero kailangan nila four. manalo two games in a row. Two games in a row against Secret, that's one hard task. Yeah. And of course, we all know Secret is a better shape over everyone. Diba? Ang ganda na nilalaro na Secret all over the DPC season. This is the first time I've seen Team Secret playing this well. All throughout, since the whole team secret, regardless to sa uh, super team na binuo nila with yeah. Kuroki, Artizi, uh, nandun yung Sinotel before, even S4 was playing for uh, Team Secret before. Yeah. But anyway, guys, 
Well, just gonna go on a short commercial break. Pagbalik natin. Game number four. Is this gonna be over? Is this gonna be the last game? That's a big question. So sit back, relax. Magbabalik ang One Boys Combo. <laughs>